You see, this uh, today's press conference is related to a very very serious issue. This issue is related to the transport department of Telangana. This issue is related to the issuance of smart cards, which is issued for driving licenses and uh, registration certificate of the vehicles. Uh, a whistleblower uh, from the company who is supplying the smart cards to uh, state of Telangana wrote me a letter and an email uh, stating that you know some irregularities are happening and some hanky panky is going on in the department. The department signed a contract with a private company some year back for supplying over on 50 lakh of uh, these uh, smart cards, and the smart cards was to be equipped with the SCOTSA guidelines of Government of India. SCOTSA guidelines is smart card operation for transport applications. So uh, these guidelines were to be followed and the guidelines states that the chips in the smart card should be of uh, uh, German origin of Samsung and that chip cost around 27, 28 of rupees. Uh, but it is found that you know this uh, this letter of the whistleblower has stated that there are following series. They are using the company is using the Chinese uh, chips. And you know it, everybody knows this, Chinese chips are of questionable uh, uh, quality and they always try to, uh, you know, jack, hack your data, so, and uh, which can be of security concern. And uh, when I found that this, this series are, uh, they, they are using Chinese series and it's a breach of security as well as breach of data uh, obligations. I met the department officials on 7th of May. I told them that this is the happening in the department. And at that time, they recognized that this may be going on. But uh, on my request, they did not do any probe. So my request is that you know this is a very, very serious issue, as the, these days, 99% crime are happening because of the vehicle, uh, vehicle-borne crimes. And in the vehicle, two people are involved. One is the driver, and another one is the vehicle. And the, both the data uh, and of both the data is stored in the smart cards. In the for the vehicle, it is more stored in RC, and for the driver, it is stored in driving license. And if data is compromised, and the Chinese chips are used, I want to tell you that in the ch Chinese chips were uh, used to hack the ch U.S. defense system as well. So you, everybody in the world, they have stopped using Chinese chips. Chinese chips. And if the Department of Telangana is using Chinese chips. They are putting the security of the citizens, not only citizens, security of states, security of the cities, as well as security of the nation at risk. My immediate uh, request and prayer to the government of Telangana is to the whistleblower has written a letter to you, as well as he's afraid of putting, uh, bringing up this issue to the, uh, in, the in the front of uh, media, because he's afraid that uh, he's threat to his life. So he has uh, approached us to raise up this issue. We are raising up this issue and requesting you to conduct a probe. And if you find that these the allegations are correct, ban the company, take legal action against them, put the penalties, as well as take corrective action. So that the security, number one, the financial scam doesn't happen. Number two, the, uh, the security is not threatened. Number three, the breach of data. Data can be of you, data can be of me, data can be of him. So data is at risk. You know artificial intelligence these days, <coughs> anything and everything can happen. So let us uh, pray God in the, in the Silicon Valley. I, I, I remember that you know I, I, I got my first internet connection from Hyderabad only. Uh, the, the company was Satyam. So uh, we are compromising with the data. We are compromising the security of the nation through the transport department officials. Uh, I'm sure that no, no transport official is involved in this, but if they are involved, district action should be taken against them. And um, if, if at all you do not initiate probe and take action, then it will be understood that somebody from the higher ups in the transport order is involved in this, and will be forced to go to the high court uh, to get justice for the people of Telangana, for the people of the nation. Thank you very much.